Hello guys, hope you are doing good. This is Sharik, your host. Today's session, I will complete cover. How can you extend root size? How can you increase the root size of CentOS or Red Hat Linux server? So guys, first you need to log into your server and check the status of your file system. So file system checking command is df half an edge. Just press enter. Once you will press enter, you can check over here what is the, your root status of file system. You are having 26 GB. So if suppose you are having around having issue or you uh, almost you almost or you are having to fully your hard disk. What will be the process you to, uh, to increase the size? So I will exp explain you every, every step. So guys, if you are first time viewer on my channel, please like and share and subscribe. So let's start. First, I will going to add new virtual hard disk to my set, uh, my VM VMware. We, we are using VMware hypervisor. So so just go to the right click on the virtual machine and uh, go to setting and click to add once you will go to add there will be option hardware type what will be the hardware type you need to select a hard disk click to next i uh, recommend scfi uh, hard disk type just click on next then you are going to create a virtual disk just again click to next and the disk size you need to collect so i don't want to split my single file so in a single file so i'm going to i'm going to use 20 gb just click on next again and the disk file is just finish and just so disk file is created just click ok once you will click ok you need to if you are going to restart your pc server it will be okay otherwise you need to scan your uh, new hard disk so new hard disk scan command you need to type eco there will be option you need to type i will take e c h o eco space double quotation space dash dash and dash three dash and and double quotation space then greater than then then the directory type which directory we are so our directory host directory always says uh, says uh, synchronize class SCI host and inside the host you we need to check so I need to or out slash SYS class class then SC S I H O host so at uh, first I will check on host 0 so I need to click on host host or I can also test on host 2 so I will going to first I will test on host and then scan so I will going to scan this so if will be if it's okay then I will go further otherwise we can again a scan then you added hard disk just click ok and we need to check the status of the new added hard disk so f d i s k f and l once you will check you need to check the new hard disk is added or no so it's still it's still it's not up there l s b l k half an l so new hard disk is not added so i need to again run the host c just to take enter so f d i s k half an l L S B L K. So guys, you can check over here. New hard disk 20 G is added. Dex is added here. So what? So how did I I have explained to you how can you scan? Otherwise, you need to reboot your server. Once you have a scan, so you need to type sudo. Or you can check the uh, directory uh, location fdisk half one l. You can check over here. Dex is this is the dex size on the one to you and get and all the block. So I need to scan my um, physical volume sudo and root. I don't need to, but it's okay. You can use it. P V S C A. Once you will type, press enter. 
so you can check over here uh, I have to scan my FDA2 volume group there is no any free space so I need to use sudo again to initialize initialize new hard new added drive dex f a d i s k half an l no need for f d i s k half an uh, forward slash d e v then s d b just press enter once you will press enter you need to create a new hard disk because i have added a new hard disk to i am going to create a new fresh hard disk file system new fresh file system you just press enter new what's the type of uh, partition i will go in for primary so it's this pay p and what kind of uh, partition you are i will go for default just press one enter once you press enter and it will be asking the default just uh, you can just enter it will be default value and again you can enter it will be again default value now the partition one of linux is size 20 gb set so i need to now i will going to check the types just t just press t and enter and you know about a uh, hexadecimal code so if you don't know about just press L you will get the so I will use Linux uh, Linux LV logical volume so just type 8 E and enter once you will type 8 E and enter so change type is partition in Linux 2 before we are having simple Linux so it's now on Linux LV so uh, press W right just press enter again it will be exit from the uh, from the initialization so now I need to check the status L S A B L K just press enter so guys you can check over here S D B and S D B1 is initialized part dex and part ok as you can check over same S D and S D B is so I need to create physical volume so the physical volume creation command is sudo ev create what is the new added drive so just press forward slash dev dev is always uh, all the directory living so in uh, dev dev directory so just uh, just type sdb1 once uh, you have typed sdb1 you need to press enter and you can you can check over here physical volume dev sdb1 is successfully created so i need to type you now once the air uh, it's successfully created i need to display the volume group the path i need to check the volume group part the so sudo vg display yes vg dis display once you will type db display what is the volume group display path is center so I will going to three. I will going to extend the volume group part. Okay, and it will be assigned with this. So I need to type sudo vg extend volume group extend extend volume gain name is centos. Just just select centos then directory the sdb1 and press it it will be scan and it will be extend to sdb1 once press enter so you can check a volume group center of sexual so we extended with uh, volume group extend of volume group extended with sdb1 so I need to again scan a physical one. 
so you can use sudo pv scan just press enter once you will press enter you can check over here guys you are getting volume group sent off 20 gb is free and you are also getting sda1 your whole partition which we have created while installation or we have getting new partition which i have created now are having 20 gb free space so the next step i will follow i need to display the logical volume so once i have a scan i need i will go for the logical volume so logical volume command is l sudo lv display once you will pipe lv display just press enter so you can check over here lv display path is logical volume path is this so logical i need to what i will go i will go to to extend this to stp1 so i need to type because i will be going to the extending the stp1 will join with this so l sudo night need to type as you do other we can also leave at sudo because i am already a root guy guys so air sudo lv because i will use logical volume so lv extend lv extend space what is the path you need to type dv c1 to centos root centos root then space and what's your uh, the directory path new file system path dev forward slash stb1 and press enter once you will press enter logical volume sent off root successfully resize so logical volume is successfully resize with what stb1 which file system i have created so i need to resize it okay so what will be the process to resize so, so need to, uh, not extending your size you can use the like a lv extend or you can first you need to test lv extend like same which i am having here have an t then r dash 1 plus 100 percent free then dev mapper centos root what is the centos the direction what the root directory just press enter because i will going to test first you will going to test the you can check over here logical volume successfully resize but there will be no any changes because i had uh, dash t i am i am using dash t for testing if you if you will just erase just delete the t and use lv extend dash r uh, dash l then plus and 100 percent free because i will use one net totally my file system to assign to the home directory so dev the home directory which i am having physical volume so just press enter once you will press enter you can check over a logical volume center uh, successfully successfully reside now before what i am having before we are having only 26 gb before i am having only 26 gb of root size so now what i am getting now now i am getting 46 gb because I have added 20 more GV. So guys, this is the process uh, to add, uh, to resize, to resize the root directory, to extend the root directory. Guys, if you having any kind of doubts, uh, any kind of conf confusion, I will glad to answer you. 
and please like share and subscribe my channel and if you are having any kind of a dots you can come on my blog queerypanel.com in my blog and my it blogger behind my channel so guys thanks for watching have a nice day